Dear brothers and sisters, in our catechesis on the family, we now turn to children who are a great gift for the church and for our human family. I think of the many happy children I saw during my recent visit to Asia, but also of the countless children throughout our world who are living in poverty and need. A society can be judged by the way it treats its children. Within our families, children remind us that from our earliest years, we are dependent on others. We see this in Jesus himself, who was born a child in Bethlehem. Children also remind us that we are always sons and daughters. Rather than being in complete control of our lives, we never cease being radically dependent on others. They challenge us to see things with a simple, pure, and trusting heart, to receive and to offer warmth and tenderness, and to laugh and cry freely in response to the world around us. Jesus urges us to become like children, since God's kingdom belongs to such as these. Let us welcome and treasure our children who bring so much life, joy, and hope to the world. How sad and bleak would our world be without them. Saluti pellegrini di lingua inglese presenti all'odierna udienza, specialmente quelli provenienti da Gran Bretagna, Danimarca, Norvegia, Svezia, Filippini, Canada e Stati Uniti di America. Su tutti voi e sulle vostre famiglie invoco la gioia e la pace del Signore Gesù. Dio vi benedica. I greet the English speaking pilgrims and visitors taking part in today's audience, including those from Great Britain, Denmark, Norway, Sweden, the Philippines, Canada, and the United States of America. Upon all of you and your families, I invoke an abundance of joy and peace in the Lord Jesus. God bless you all. Dominus obiscum, et con spiritu tuo, sit nomen Domini benedictum, et sofnum, et usque in seculum, aiutare nostrum in nomine Domini, qui feci celum et terram. Benedica vos omnipotes Deus, Pater, Filius, Espiritus Santo. Amen. Amen.